Hey, what's up guys? It's Kyle Jones with Jones Sport Fishing and here is your daily buoy tan Astoria report. Um, so today is the 13th of August. I believe it's Tuesday. Um, I'm starting to get tired. But um, yeah, so fishing was uh, fishing today. Um, kind of depended who you were and what you were doing and uh, if you landed on biters or not. Um, I, I don't know. I'm going to say it right now. I definitely did not have the number of bites that I did yesterday. Um, I did much better yesterday than I did today. Uh, I landed, I got the same number of keepers, but I only landed four fish today and we killed three. So, uh, had a couple others hooked up, but just did not have, you know, kind of the double digit bites that we had yesterday. And I don't know. I don't know why they just, the fish weren't as snappy. There was, there was not as many fish around. Um, I went up. So yeah, I, here, yeah, I'll probably should tell you what I did. I went up and I started the exact same program as it did yesterday. I pulled out there at that red number 44 buoy. Uh, I ran up there, dropped in and started trolling up. And there was, I watched my brother, as soon as his stuff went in, he had a fish on immediately and there was fish around. Uh, they just were not as snappy. I just couldn't quite get things to bite. I, I don't know, my program, I just didn't feel, I don't know, sometimes you just don't feel like you have the mojo. And for whatever reason, today I just felt like my mojo was a little bit off. That's really, I think all I can, uh, I can uh, chalk it up to running bait on my front rods uh, they got bit a little bit they didn't get bit like they did yesterday um, and then most of our bites today were on a pink hoochie spinner with um, I don't know of course it's I've got one of them it's like it's this water boy blade and it's gold and it's orange with a gold stripe in it it's I think it's a number four I don't know what size it is Sam picked it out of my box it's a one-off that I got from uh, my buddy Gary and yeah it's uh it's hammering fish it's like three days in a row so i've been trying to mess with blades to that kind of look like that one and it seems like uh i don't know i don't know i don't know uh there was a there was a lot of fish around i don't know these slack tides is the, this can happen you get these really um really soft tides and this point in the month like there's fish around but the estuary is just not chocked full of them so like w this when this happens later in the month the estuary is just loaded with fish because that's just the time when there's a lot of fish there and we smash them when it does this at this kind of point in the month like the fishing can be really good and if you land on them and you land on biters you can you can whack them and it's kind of laid back fishing because you control kind of whatever direction you want to and big long trolls and that kind of thing and uh but yeah it's just kind of here one here one there i mean i saw at times some decent little flurries from the fleet but other than that um that just wasn't really hopping but uh yeah so that's kind of the report from today so tomorrow um i think well what do you think you guys did good henry even got his fish today uh henry was with brett they did they did pretty dang good they kind of did what i did brett and i kind of flipped from yesterday to today he wasn't as on fire yesterday and yesterday I did pretty good. And today, um, he got me, but that, that's not gonna last long, <laughs> but, uh, or shouldn't, hopefully it doesn't last long. He's a good fisherman. So, um, yeah, I'm going to probably run similar program with the softer tide. So we're going to, we're going to have more of that incoming tide tomorrow. So I will probably drop down river on the Oregon side. I won't probably start at tongue point. I'll probably, start maybe like down there kind of closer to the east basin maybe even as far down as the bridge and kind of work my way up toward tongue point and sort of just see what starts happening um yeah i bet you guys don't have a fungo bat in your truck with you anyway i'm getting tired i got eggs to cure got stuff to do rods to re-rig and uh food to eat so anyway guys we, fish is good down here. I'm re really excited for next week. We get the big tides, but we're going to keep working through this, these, uh, these tides right now. We're going to see some pretty good fishing. So that's my report. Not, not a ton of stuff to report. I don't have an aha moment or anything like that. Just, uh, go out and fish hard and have fun. And the Lord blesses us with, uh, all sorts of wonderful things, guys. So God bless you guys. And I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye.